Hey everybody, it is your girl Sincerely Drake and I'm back today with another video. So as I see time below, y'all, the final stretch is here. Y'all already saw another graduation vlog, but this is like real deal graduation. This is the graduation for everybody. And I'm super excited about it. Um, so today is the day before graduation, just to get y'all up. Why I look so shiny right now? Good moisturized skin. But today's the day before graduation. I am out in Atlanta, I'm back home to get my hair done. If you saw the other vlog, I had braids in that. I took those out. I got it washed by Grace, the stylist, yesterday. She's located in Morrow, Georgia, if y'all are interested in going. And today I'm getting my hair or my wig installed. So super excited about that. There should be another video on my first impressions on the wig that's getting installed and after. But today my hair won't be fully done when I'm done. I'm getting it done in pink curls because graduation is tomorrow and y'all I just really don't have the time to be trying to do my own hair. So yeah super excited. I'm just gonna sit here and chill in the car get my head prepared to be sitting in here for who knows how long. Um but yeah, super excited, super excited. So y'all just stay tuned for what this day has in store. I'm not sure how much I'm gonna include in here because I'm also gonna be taking my last round of graduation pictures on Sunday, but it depends on how long the vlog is, if I'll include that in this vlog or make it another one. But either way it goes, it's vlog season. Y'all know what's happening. Graduation season, almost done. Big grad in the building. You already know what it is, class of 22. Don't play with me. It still feels weird saying class of 22 class of 2022 because i'm supposed to be class of 2023 but whatever i'm here checking in finna sign out you know what's popping so yeah like i said i gotta get my head prepared before i go in here so i'll talk with y'all either when i get in there or when i'm done so yeah see y'all later I'm gonna try it. Some vibes, bow head type stuff. I'm done. Okay, y'all. Okay, y'all. So I just got out. The hair is done. The hair is pinned up. Ooh, y'all. It's like we're almost there. So she put like some nets on my hair so that I can like go about my day and the clips won't fall out the hair won't fall out the curls all that sort of stuff but i'm super excited y'all i'm super excited even just seeing like the edges y'all know i don't be doing that but i love it the only thing i would say is probably like the lace probably needs to be a little darker but i don't know because i'm new to this stuff but i'm super excited right now my next thing to do i really need to use the bathroom not super crazy but it's time to find us some food because I haven't eaten anything all day today. The only thing that I had was this smooth that I didn't even finish. I went in at 10.30. I'm just getting out. It's 2 p.m. So I'm going to figure out if I'm going to get food. I know I'm also going to this place called The Yard, which is like this milkshake place here in Atlanta. So I'm going to go there before I go home because I've been thinking about that since I dropped off the wig like two, three days ago. So... I'll take y'all along for whatever else I do today and let's get something to eat because I'm hungry. Okay, y'all, so I'm in the yard. I just got my shake. This is how it comes if like you're getting it to go, which is perfect because I'm finna drive home and I don't need to get all over the car. But I got the um I got the cookie butter meat uh which I can't remember what's in it. It's like cinnamon stuff and all that. But this is gonna be amazing. When I eat it later, when I get to the house, I'll let y'all know how it is. But I'm super excited. Let me grab it. This is what it looks like. Super cute, super cute. So we also have like ice cream and stuff like that. See, I'm gonna go head back in the car and get home because I've been out for way too long. I'm ready to take a nap. I have other stuff to do to prepare for tomorrow. So let's go. I'll see y'all when we get home. 
hey y'all hey y'all so i am back it is actually the end of the day y'all know i'm working on the vlogging but actually y'all didn't miss anything all it is like i said i came back home from the yard i ate oh i told i didn't tell y'all but i decided to go to chick-fil-a and i got the south or i don't know if it's south but i got the bacon barbecue sandwich that they had and i got it on a crispy chicken and that was good y'all should try it it's seasonal so hopefully this video comes out before they're done doing it and i know they don't have it at every location because i know when i was looking thinking about getting it the other day when i was talking to my hairdresser who washed and blow dried my hair that was in this vlog and i was looking forward to explain it to her it wasn't on the menu for the location over there so i don't know but y'all should try it it's super good um then I had the milkshake. That was good. I shared some of that with my niece. And then literally, I was knocked out, y'all. I don't know. Maybe I was just super tired from not really getting that much sleep last night on top of going to get my hair done and just being tired all day. So I was basically asleep from the time I got home until maybe like 9 or 10 p.m. So after that, it was pretty much go mode for me. The only thing that I did was I... Of course, ate some dinner, watched some of the circle, the new season that they have, and then I started just getting stuff prepared for tomorrow. Big thing that I did was just I put a whole lot of suitcases, a whole lot of empty suitcases in the car so that tomorrow when we get there, because if you saw the vlog before this, should be the vlog before this, the um, other graduation vlog, I moved a okay amount of stuff back here last time the biggest thing on my dad's list that he had for me to bring back was my mini fridge because that takes up the most space in the car so we already brought that home but i still have a good amount of clothes there and cleaning supplies so i just put a whole bunch of empty suitcases in there if it get used it gets used if it doesn't it doesn't but i'd rather have it than not have it i still won't be fully moving out tomorrow either only because since i'm already i had to stay to finish checking all the rooms from all the residents all the final residents should have left yesterday or today, I guess. <laughs> Everybody should have left today. The only people left should be our graduates because of course they have to stay for graduation and then anyone who's staying over the summer. So it shouldn't be too, too much, but just put the stuff there. I was gonna show y'all me doing my nails for tomorrow, but I'm realizing that I guess I left it at school, which is so crazy. I left the dress that I'm supposed to wear for tomorrow at school. So I'm going to wear a different dress going and I'll change when I get there later on. Um, but I'm just like, oh my gosh, because I was going to put my nails and I was going to, I was saving to show y'all that later on tonight, but I left it at school, but it's okay because I don't really necessarily need them. I'm not a big fan nails girl i usually wear my natural nails all the time the only reason why i'm doing nails is because i'm doing my last photo shoot on sunday so it's okay it's fine for me to not have my nails for tomorrow because that means i'll be able to help more with packing and i just put my nails on on saturday after i work for move out and all of that to be prepared for sunday so that's fine i'll show y'all that in either this vlog or the next vlog however i end up doing this so the only thing left that I'm going to be doing for tonight is washing my face, brushing my teeth, taking a shower, and then I'm working on backing up some videos for y'all because now that school is over, I'm on the YouTube stuff. I already have like four videos edited, uploaded, scheduled, ready to post for y'all. So I'm back on it. Y'all will be getting these consistent videos like how it used to be before this school year started. It's 2.37 in the morning and we are leaving out of here at like 6 a.m. because my first thing is a brunch for my entrepreneurship certificate that starts at like nine in the morning. So we just wanna make sure that we're on that side of town, on that side of town before traffic because there's a whole bunch of graduations. Athens gonna be packed tomorrow. So let me stop rambling. Let me go to sleep. I'll see y'all tomorrow when I officially become a graduate of the University of Georgia. Excited. It's still kind of surreal. I think this is kind of how it was for me when I graduated high school. Like, it just felt really surreal. Like, yeah, I know I'm graduating, but I, it, it hasn't really hit me just yet. But it's whatever. I'll talk to y'all tomorrow. Good morning, good morning, y'all. It is officially graduation day. Hey, hey, hey. Low energy because it's like five something in the morning. I'm ready. This is the dress I'm gonna be wearing because the dress that I had is at school. Um, I'll probably change it to that later. Just for the first event for today, I'll wear this. 
don't mind this on my face because I really have a long drive to get on to get to Athens, but I just want to check in with y'all to say good morning. Happy graduation day. I'll see y'all in Athens. I need to go back to sleep. I got maybe like 30, 40 minutes of sleep, so I'm gonna go back. But I'll see y'all in Athens. Hey y'all, so we are here, we're in Athens, we're outside of Studio 225, which is the entrepreneurship building. So I'm gonna go ahead and all my family already went in. I was just working on my hair, as y'all just saw. Um, I didn't know that this wig that I bought was this short. It's cute, but I wanted longer hair. It's okay, it's whatever. It's cute and classy, I guess. But, um, I'm gonna go head in and we'll see what's going on. It's just kind of weird because it's like, I guess it, since it's super early in the morning, it's like cold. It's like 60 something degrees and it really hasn't been 60 something degrees in a long time, at least from what I know. So I don't know. And it's kind of gloomy, me, but I'm gonna head inside and see what's going on. Right now we're going to a brunch. I don't know if I said that before, but we're going to a brunch for my entrepreneurship certificate. So I'm gonna head in. I'll probably show y'all the food or whatever the case may be. And I'll see y'all later. So, this is the spread. Okay, today, I think it's Mama's Boy. It looks like Mama's Boy. So, you know it's finna bust. But let me eat. I'm excited. Okay, y'all. We are pulling up to graduation ceremony number two. I'm changed. I have the cap on. Got the new dress on, and I need to get in this line because I'm a little late. But see y'all. Yeah. <laughs> She's a smart girl. She I know has she's two tassels. Like whether it's like like a fun little play Y'all never did y'all see? Yeah, y'all did to the hair earlier. Mm -hmm. So, Whoa! Caribsa. Right Cause we love being black. And then I have a cord. This is for dog camp, because I was a dog camp counselor. But we're just waiting. Waiting to get in. But hair is still doing what it needs to do. It's not too hot, but pro tip, fam, I take this everywhere. Y'all, I be taking this to the parties because one thing about me, I'm not gonna be sweating. It's so cool because like, I did some school in COVID, so I didn't really see some of my teachers full face. I didn't know like what the bottom half of their face looked like. And now I'm seeing them full face and I'm like, oh my gosh. You have a face. Okay, I'm ready to go in, but we have to wait until 1.30, so about 10-ish more minutes before we get to go in. And I think I'm gonna go to Chick-fil-A after this, because apparently in Athens, if you go to any Chick-fil-A with your cap and your gown, it is free for the dinner. So I'm gonna do that. And then after this, we're gonna go back to the room and pack some stuff before the last graduation which starts at 7.30, but it's in a open, the doors open at five. So I'm pretty sure we're gonna be there at five, but we have time to pack and take naps or whatever the case may be in between. So, yeah. Walking on? Let me not trip. We're going in. Ooh -wee -ooh -wee. I'm a whole job. Teaching. And still, somehow, people worked and got it done in very 
semester here today is proof to that. Things you would think would get better the next semester, but I think it just got weirder in the fall, right? Yeah. <laughs> wanted to wait till we got Congratulations, class of 2022. <laughs> Finding my family, finding my family, it's gonna take forever. I almost cried at the beginning, y'all, oh my gosh. But real Jews don't cry. Let's find my folks. Are you ready? Are you ready? Yes! Look on this side. You can have a... y'all hey y'all so we are at the final event for the day we were all I did in between last clip and now is I just worked on packing my room like my feet hurt I didn't even put my heels on just yet cuz just walking in my regular shoes my feet hurt cuz I've been on my feet trying to pack my room up while everybody else is like eating taking naps whatever the case may be so I'm waiting on one of my friends to go in because Y'all already know, since I'm graduating a year early, like, I don't really know a lot of people. Like, I know people, I don't know a lot of people, but since I didn't come in with them, I don't really have, like, those friendships with a lot of them. So, I want to walk in with some people that I know. So, I'm waiting on her. But this is where I got to go in. It's looking like a whole lot of excellence to me. But, yeah, I'll show y'all what it looks like once we get in there on the field. I won't be able to sit with her, though, because we're graduating from two different schools, but... At least I'll have someone to walk in with. So yeah, I'll talk to y'all later. Literally. Okay, graduate one, graduate two, graduate three! Don't play with us! Don't play with us! Get out of here. Almost out here. Almost out Now, very close. I don't know where to go. I think I'm sitting on this side. What, what? Oh wait, I'm, I'm on the, the south thing. side, yeah. I think. Oh, I don't even know. We're right ooh, next to each other, ooh, actually. Ooh, yeah. I don't really know. Oh, now we can't walk in the hills yet. Oh, maybe I should put mine on. Oops! Oh, boy! We're almost there. Just got here. Super late. And it's super packed. And somehow, I gotta see you in the front! Okay, you see me, you see us. I think they have these cute little bags. Okay. Never bark alone. It has a program, some water. Yeah. Super excited. I'm gonna make some TikTok. Y'all follow me on TikTok because I got some cute TikToks coming up for y'all. Let me make them though.
Nation. UGA said, right here, shine. It's going to continue. So. College of Arts and Sciences instills in its an adventurous spirit of inquiry, a love of learning, the ideals of community and global citizenship, and the values of hard work and service to others. The faculty and I are confident that the Franklin College has provided these graduates with the skills, the knowledge, and the sensibilities that will empower them to make meaningful contributions to our society. President Moorhead, with pride and with delight, the faculty, the Franklin College and I present for the degrees of Bachelor of Arts, Bachelor of Sciences, Bachelor of Fine Arts, Bachelor of Science and Chemistry, and Bachelor of Music. Will these candidates <laughs> <laughs> By the authority vested in me as president of the University of Georgia by the Board of Regents, I now confer on you the degrees of Bachelor of Arts, Bachelor of Science, Bachelor of Fine Arts, Bachelor of Science and Chemistry, and Bachelor of Music for, for which you have been recommended by your dean and faculty with all the rights, privileges, and responsibilities thereto appertaining. Congratulations. We can wrap it up. Sciences. With the fun. We're a deep-rooted community, centuries old and over 300,000 strong.
Was it walking onto Tate Plaza after yeah, your first class? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Was it the first time you saw the inside of Sanford Stadium? Woo. Or was it a thousand miles from home and you heard two simple words? Go dogs. Go dogs! The University of Georgia honors that moment every day by bringing alumni together year-round, worldwide, and lifelong. Yeah. Whether you were a first-gen grad or born wearing red and black, being a Bulldog is more than a memory or even a degree. We're a deep-rooted community, centuries old and over 300,000 strong. As the birthplace of public higher education in America, we instill a tenacity that gives our graduates an advantage in the working world. Our family reunions embody the Georgia spirit. And we're empowering the next breed of bulldogs who will continue that tradition. So think back to the moment you became a bulldog. Wear it on your sleeve. You join the hundreds of thousands doing the same. We're united by the arch and the hedges. By Broad Street and Millage Avenue. Yeah. And the sound, glory, glory. We are UGA alumni. We never yeah, bark along. Know it.
Okay, y'all, so it's now the end of graduation day. It's actually past three in the morning. So y'all have missed anything after graduation. I think I took some videos, I'm not sure. I can't, I don't think I did. But after graduation, we just went over to Tate. Um, Tate Plaza, which is where usually after graduation, if you are familiar with NPHC Greek organizations, a lot of them end up doing like a lot of their like, I don't know what the formal word for it is because I'm not part, but I guess like senior presentation. So I guess like they're basically, they sent off their graduates by doing like their sort of sorority of fraternity thing. So I went there to go support some of my friends. And also there's this thing at UGA called it's not called anything, but basically seniors can pay for this thing called a class gift. $10 goes to the gift, and then you get to donate $20 to any cause on campus. So for me, I donated my 20 extra dollars to Georgia Days, which helps with recruiting more minorities and increasing the percentage of black people here on campus, which I'm all here for because we're at 6.6% .6 right now. We need to get that back up. We used to be 8%, so we gotta get back up. Um, but yeah, and the other 10 goes to a gift. And basically when you do that, you're able to put your signature, your name on a plaque. So the class of 22 plaque went up just a few days ago. And of course I was at home, so I didn't see it. So I was able to go and show my parents. I saw my name and I will live there forever. So I'm super excited about that. Um, after that, we just came back to the room and I got some more of my stuff moved out. So this is what the room is looking like now. I don't mind all the trash. I got to get all those things thrown away. But everything is basically gone for the most part. It's just the last few things because I'm still here for two more days. So I have some cleaning stuff. The toaster was supposed to go. I don't know why that's here actually. But whatever. All the stuff was from today. Like my bags and stuff. I need to put those pillows back in my room. Food. All these suitcases out here are empty. So it's for anything else that I need to pack to take on my last day, which I hope is Sunday. Um, that's some stuff I'm giving to one of my friends. And then my room is pretty much empty. I already saw in the other vlog, I took everything off the walls. Everything is out of there. My closet is empty, which is wild. I just have plastic bags in a um, duffel bag. If I have to add anything else, that's the bag for it. Y'all can't even see. But there we go. That's the bag for my comforter and stuff. My wig should have left today as well. But basically, I'm almost out bad. I'm almost done. I have this night. So I have two more nights, if you include this night, um, left here at the University of Georgia as an undergrad. I mean, I'm officially now a graduate of the University of Georgia. Y'all saw me turn my tassel. I'm so excited. Super, super excited, but um, I do need to go to bed because since I'm an RA, I told y'all, work calls for tomorrow. We're doing a team potluck at noon. So we have to go to the store before that to get some stuff. Me and some of my RA friends are gonna go to the store. So I need to go to sleep so I can do that with them and we can start cooking before the potluck. And then we have all hands on deck to move some of these buildings out starting at like one, I think. So. Let me go to bed. I think this is gonna be the end of this vlog, this graduation vlog, this caps graduation. But stay tuned, make sure you subscribe to the notification bell so you know when the next vlog comes out. I'm gonna vlog again tomorrow for this weekend because I think this vlog was long enough. And tomorrow's weekend, or to, this weekend's vlog is just gonna be uh, my last photo shoot and my final, final moving out. So stay tuned for that. Also make sure you follow me on Instagram at IsaacCDree so you can stay up to date with me because of course I post on there way more than here. And I'm I love you all so, so much. Y'all, it's the end of the road. It's the end of a chapter. I will have a lot of videos that come out if y'all want any videos or want to know anything about my experience here at UGA or what to do post-grad or what to do within your different years or how to graduate early. You all know I graduated in three years, if not four. Um, if you want any information on anything, let me know down in the comments down below or feel free to DM me on Instagram because of course I respond to you over there. But I love you all so, so, so much and I'll see y'all literally in a couple of hours. Bye.